Hello, my name is Alex Thurston, and today I'll be showing you how to edit and configure the PDF reporting feature in the Vanta PC software. The PDF reporting feature can be used to incorporate a company's logo or any image information that's associated with the chemistry result from the instrument. In order to edit the PDF feature, we're going to go into the PC software and specifically the fleet manager portion of the software. Once into the fleet manager portion of the software, for the connected instrument that we have, if we don't already have a fleet profile associated with that instrument, we're going to want to create it. In order to create the fleet profile, simply select the plus icon at the bottom of the screen. I already have a fleet profile created for this instrument, so I am going to edit it by simply selecting the pencil icon at the bottom of the screen. In this screen now for editing this profile, I can see that at the top I have a Users tab, a Templates tab, and a Libraries tab. We're going to want to select the Templates tab for this activity. On the left-hand side of the screen in the Templates tab, select PDF Report, and you can see that you have three default templates, a default template, Layout 1, and Layout 2. Uh, in order to edit one of these, simply select the template that you would like to edit and then click the pencil icon at the bottom of the screen. If you would like to create a template, you can simply select the plus icon at the bottom of the screen as well. I'm going to edit layout one now. So in this screen, in the editing of the template, you can see that on the left hand side of the screen, we have drop down menus for both orientation and the page size of the PDF report. So once I have those selections set, in addition to this information, I have the toggled items down below for a number of different aspects from the test. So any chemistry or notes or potentially the aiming image associated with the test can be imported into the PDF template. Additionally, if I would like to add a company logo, I would select company logo and then do this by pressing the import button at the bottom of the screen which is the up arrow with the bar underneath. When I select that button a file structure comes up to where I have a folder now and I should be able to select a .png file. The .png file is critical because it's the only file type that the PDF reporting template will identify with so by using uh, my PNG file from my desktop and importing into this folder, I'm all set. I'll select the PNG file, open, and it's into the, the template now. The content on the actual PDF template can be adjusted by simply moving around the box by clicking and dragging, or by clicking on the dots on the side of the content and adjusting as we see fit. So once my content is adjusted as I would like, the software auto saves the template and I just need to hit the back button in order to exit. I need to deploy now my profile to my device. And then after rebooting, the new PDF reporting template is now on the device. And that's it. The PDF template is now on the instrument. I hope this video was informative for you and I thank you for watching.